Hello everyone, welcome back to Transport Fever 2 on the Stepford map. Now, uh, you, you can see I'm look we're looking here at our uh, massive uh, urban area here. Uh, this town growth is due to proximity of the towns and the natural town growth mod. Now, if I zoom in, you'll see the traffic's absolutely horrendous. I'm not going to zoom in. I'm going to ignore it. I'm instead going to go over here. Now, way down here, we have the Florin Food Processing Plant. And I'm just, I'm going to bring that online. Uh, and that is, now, all of the remaining farms on the map, though, are all up here. So I'm going to grab the food output, or the grain from these four farms here, and bring that down to the Florin Food Processing Plant. Now, there's a reasonable route, uh, you know, through this way, punch through, come through here, and up this way. So that's what I'm going to do. So the first thing I need to do is, you know, chuck some stations down. So we'll grab a station, stick it here, and this is going to be the Hill Valley Farm. See? See? Hill Valley Farm. Now, up here, this is the Winchesterton Fieldville Farm. Yeah, I did call a town Winchesterton Fieldville. Uh, okay, so we'll put that here. And that will be Winchesterton Fieldville Farm. Right. And then, these two also need to join the party. So, uh, I'll stick one in here like this and one in here I'm gonna put it up top here um, like this so this is pork belly farm so this will be pork pork belly farm right and this one over here is pork pork belly farm whoops Number two. Farm number two. Yeah, okay. So, I'm going to need uh, to get a track up there from here, and it's going to need to have a two way passing track here. So, we'll go on tracks. Yep. We don't need uh, catenary because I'm not going to run electric. So, we'll uh, just run a. Uh, Aha, uh -huh. we're gonna... How? We're gonna have to... Well, we can get up. Yeah, we can get all the way up. Uh, okay. Uh, well, first of all, let's, uh, let's finish setting up this station here. Um, so we'll do this. And do this, yeah. Um, I may end up having to do some editing on this one to get the um, to get the Um, attracts in. Uh, okay, so, um, right, I'm going to uh, take out the extraneous catenary there. Now, I need to get up a fair ways here. I need to get up to about level with the town, so I'm going to uh, stick a track here. Okay. That's our uh, uh, meeting point. Now, can I get all the way up to there in a direct line? Too much slope, so no. Uh, in that case, I'm going to need to do some of this. What if I do this? 
Wow, that's a big gouge. You know what? I'm going to go with it. Okay. Now. Yeah, if I do that. Now I should be able to. Yeah, now I can make it. Now if I do this. Yeah. Okay. I'm going to take this out. And put a track above ground. Yep. Now what we're going to do is we're going to get out the smoothing gun. Uh, we'll maximize everything. We'll do this. Now. Yeah, it looks a little less stark. And here as well. Right. So that's a lot less stark. Uh, okay. So if you ever wonder why rail lines do this sort of loopy thing, this is why. It's getting them up to uh, or down to a specific level. Now, I should be able to just uh, chuck in the uh, second uh, track all the way up to here. Right. Okay. So that wasn't nearly as annoying as it could have been. Now, I need to split the track. Uh, no, not like that. So we'll go like this. Um, do that. And do this. So we're going to have a bit of a Y thing going on. Okay. Now, from here, we do this. And this. And then we look and see how ugly it is. It's not. Okay. We can live with that. Now, we need to come up here like that. Well, if I make the Y a little less aggressive, yeah, we'll make it a little less aggressive. Yeah, that's a little less bad. Okay, so we'll do that. And uh, like this. Right, so you're just uh, you're just slinging tracks at everything, right? Yeah, that's exactly what I'm doing. Uh, right now, I need to get up to here as well, uh, so I'll just wang this down here, and that looks okay. So we'll uh, just uh, wang in another track, and uh, and we can go ahead and do this. Yeah, now you're gonna go and take those uh, catenaries out again, aren't you? Or catenaries, if you prefer. Uh, right. Okay. Now we need to come down through here. And again, we're going to need a pair of passing tracks. But first of all, we'll do this. Now, uh, passing tracks again. So, like this. And then, let's see if we can just bowl our way straight up here. Um, wait up. We got a bridge over the road. We got a cheeky tunnel, which doesn't have to be a tunnel. If we use that, yeah, I think that's better. Well, that actually uh, worked out quite nice. Okay, so we'll do this. Well, sometimes things just work, don't they? Now, if we come out here and we force that level uh, back up, do this, yeah, and that. And can we get this out here? Nope, we need more track, level. Yeah. I might not need to edit this too much. Okay, we'll do that. Double slip that. Yep. Okay, so now we've got that uh, attached. Now we need to do our big run down to... Where is it? Um, Florin. Where's Florin? 
if I had it. Uh, where is it? Florin, over here, right. Okay. Right, and I needed to come up. Oh, we've got one over here at... Uh, I've got things all turned around, don't I? No. Yes. Is it this way? Yeah. Okay, I had things all turned around. Uh, so Florin is down here. Yes. Okay. So... I'm going basically straight up. So, uh, let's uh, let's put in a uh, station here. Uh, so this is going to be well. I'm probably going to need at least one pickup track, uh, pickup platform. Although I do have a food, I can deliver food to Florin, and this will make another metro area down here if I do that. Well, that's actually not a terrible idea. Um, okay, so that well, I'll need maybe two drop-off tracks. I could do four drop-offs. I could do a four-platform station. I don't know that I need that, though. I'll make it a two-platform station, and if I need something more, I'll do it. Uh, I need to go, yeah, so I'll put it on a slight angle compared to the uh, food processing plant. Now, that's a Florin food processing plant, so this is going to be the Florin food processing plant. And we'll take that extraneous backslash out of there. Yeah. Okay. Now... Down here, I need to get a road out of the way. You're deleting the whole road. Yeah, I know. Uh, because it's all wobbly and gravel, and I'm going to end up rebuilding it anyway. Uh, okay, so I'm going to need uh, some tracks coming out of here. Kind of like that. Right? And we'll put one of these in. Right, okay, so we have that. While we're here, we'll uh, rebuild that road, which is going to be one of these, uh, which is going to have one of those. And we're going to... We're going to come off of this one. Yep. Okay, and while we're at it, we're going to to put a uh, bridge in. Um, how far up does it have to be? And we'll make it a stone bridge. I think, yeah. Okay, so we'll do this, and we don't need that much, huh? You know what? We'll make it a nice uh, uh, viaduct thing, because uh, I don't feel like spending the time fiddling around a uh, cut on that. And then this can come around into there, go through a nice uh, valley, and that reconnects the two towns. Right. Um, good. Now, uh, let's put the ugly on. Uh, so, so I originally thought going up through this valley would be the way, but no, this is actually the better path. Uh, right where the road goes, in fact. So, we'll uh, actually go through right about there and work our way uh, downward. Kind of like that. 
This does slow down the uh, the track somewhat, but now from there, I think I can just wang it straight in. Yeah, I can. Um, so I can just wang this straight up as well. Yep. Straight up to here. Good. Now, from here, I need to go up past Trantor, and I'm aiming for a Hill Valley up here. Uh, so, uh, what I need to do, I need to come past Trantor, and then I think I punch through the mountain here. Although, I could try coming through the pass and working my way down around that way. You know, I might do that, actually. Okay. So, we'll keep on uh, running our uh, rail line up this way. Uh, we need to go past Trantor. So, let's, uh, let's do some sort of a bypass thing. Uh, like this. Yeah. Okay. I could have gone right through Trantor, but no real need to, so I didn't. Uh, what I do need to do is take a couple of extraneous roads out of the way. Uh, right. So now we uh, come around this way. So I'm using the ugly display here as a means of finding the uh, relatively minimal uh, slopes. Uh, now I'm going to need to, I think, uh, rebuild this road through the pass as well. Um, yeah, I'm going to need to straighten it at the very least. So we'll take this out. Right. Um, okay, put the ugly back on. We need to come up the pass. So, say to about here. And wang our way around here. Uh, no. Uh, we need to be aiming upward. That's going down. That's not what we want. Uh, okay. Back that off. And maybe even back this off a bit more. Yeah. Okay. Now, we'll uh, angle over this way. Angle over this way. Yep. Then we can angle around this way. That's still okay. We still want up. Okay. Now, we want to still go up. And I think we'll punch through that one. Yep. And I think we can punch through that one as well. Okay. Good. Well, that uh, that solves that. Okay, so put another track on it. You know, we have lots of cash at this point, so we can build pretty much whatever it is we want. So that's what I'm going to do. Build whatever it is I want. Okay, we have that. Uh, now, um, get rid of that. Uh, go and build and rebuild your uh, road. Uh huh. I'm holding shift to stop it snapping. Um, but anyway, uh, we're going to go up, and I think, I think no, I can do this, and then this, and then this. Yeah. Okay. So there's that.
Now, I need to angle up past Mega City 1 and head up Valley. Okay. Well, in that case, uh, well, I think I kind of want to do that because that goes over the road. So we'll give that give that an iron bridge. Yeah, we'll give that an iron bridge. Now, if I do this, yeah, that's probably better. Okay. Uh, right. Good. Now, we're going past Mega City 1, straight for Hill Valley. Okay, so we need to get past Mega City 1 over to, to, over to about there, which means we need to work our way down the mountain this time. Uh, which we can do this way a couple of slow uh, corners, right? Right, okay, so that gets us down. Good. Now, this is a freight line, so it's not so critical if it's a bit slow. Um, right, now, where's Hill Valley? I'm going straight that way. Let's look at the ugly. Uh, okay, so we'll be working our way down a fair margin. And then I think punch through here. Yeah, so we're aiming for this, uh, this gap thingy. Yeah, okay. Well, uh, we're still going downhill. Yeah, uh, we'll take this here uh, road out of the way. Uh, punch some more rail in. Yeah. Uh, and of course, uh, I'm going to put the road back. Like this. Bridge pillar collision. There we go. Yeah, that'll do. And then you can go up to there. Yep. Now, I can take some of the approaches out and make them embankments. Right? Okay. Back to our... Uh, uh, our uh, track adventure. Um, okay. Okay. It looks like I need to bend around to this side. Okay, so we'll back it up to here and bend around this way. Uh, like this. Right. Uh, okay, yeah, that uh, lets us continue going downward. Now, I need to punch through about here. So, okay, I need to get around a bit more. How bad's that? That's okay. Uh, okay, that will work. Now what do we need to do? We need to pop out here. Okay. So if I do this, we're still going downhill. And we get, oh, we get a... No, I'll keep that tunnel. Uh, okay, so let me do this. Uh, yep. So this is a whacking great uh, freight line, and it's probably going to bring in a whacking great amount of cash. Now let's look at this. We could go around this way, or we could go over this way. Uh, so let's uh, let's just take a look. We got a lot of. tunneling going around that way yeah okay now but if we go around this way okay 
Okay, I think we'll go around that way and see what we get. Okay, so it's relatively level around that far. That's going up. Uh-huh. We don't want that to go up. I don't think. I don't think we do. Let's just uh, let's just run that and see what what we get when we come up to here. Okay, come on. Need to get up here so I can make it connect. Now, if I do this, that's a big cut. And that's a viaduct. Uh, yeah, I don't think I want to take that line if it's going to do that, so I'll uh, back this up. Yeah. So I'm just going to go straight through. Uh, so we'll take a look here. Uh, go around this way. Uh, that stays relatively level, and then I can punch through. Yeah. Then, the question is, uh, what's the, what's this like? Okay, now if I do this, well, I'm going to take that, uh, and then... I'm going to realign it. See how much I can realign it. Okay, so can I come out this way? Yeah, I think I can. And then if I come this way, take this out. Yeah. Okay, now if I do it this way, like that. Uh, yep. Yeah, I think that's better. Okay, so I'll go for that. Okay. This means that we now have our whacking great long rail line. Now this might serve as a sort of main line later. Uh, I'm not sure. I might use this right of way to run some passenger uh, lines through as well. Uh, okay. Uh, what's nice is that we came in under the existing rail line there, uh, which uh, certainly makes things a little bit uh, less congested and complicated. Okay, so that's uh, that's a uh, big rail line going down to uh, Florin, which is over here. Yeah, so uh, I'm going to end up uh, running some uh, massive uh, trains on here. Uh, so what I'm going to do, uh, first up, I'm going to put two signals in. I'm going to put a signal here. I'm just going to put a couple of signals in at the uh, the uh, stations right uh, and then I'm going to run a single train on here oh yeah I'm gonna need uh, signals at the Y I'm gonna run a single train from this one up here um, yeah, and I'm going to do this by, well, actually, yeah, no, yes, no, I'm going to run it from the, uh, from this end. You are, are you? Yeah, I'm going to, um, okay, so I'm going to need, uh, one of these 
and uh, a building. Yeah, it's a building. Um, yeah, one of those. Uh, and we can st stick that in there. Yeah. Now, I'm going to buy a train. Locos. We have diesel locos. We have GP9s. Okay. Yeah, the, the time has rolled forward. So that's 1305. That's 809. That's 1.1. Yeah, GP9s are uh, cheaper to run. So I'm going to chuck a GP9 on there. Cargo. We're going to need gondolas. Uh, that's, uh, that's 120. Um, yeah, I'll, I'll go with that. Okay, so that's, uh, three times load, uh, 20 tons. Yeah, we'll go with that one. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight of them is the maximum we can stick on there with a 160 meter platform. I'd have to extend the platforms to avoid issues with switches. Uh, right. Okay, we'll buy a train. And uh, we'll put it on a new line, which will be way up here. This down to uh, here. So, this is going to be cargo rail, pork belly, farm two to Florin, uh, food pea. Yeah. Okay. Now, what we're going to do for the rest of this episode is ride the train. Yep. That's, that's going to be the entire rest of the episode. Uh, riding the train and maybe fixing some uh, issues with the track. Uh, it didn't flag any issues, so it should make it just fine. Uh, so that's that's gonna be gonna be it. So uh, I'm gonna actually stop talking at this point. I'll let you uh, uh, ride the train in peace. Uh, this should be a nice long ride, and uh, yeah. So I'll I'll do the sign off now. Uh, so stay healthy. Don't let the ongoing apocalypse get you down too much. And uh, see you back next time for uh, uh, another project of some description. Uh, so anyway, yeah, here's the train ride, and I'm going to stop talking.